Hey everyone, welcome back to Evictor's efficient and safe building channel. Today, we're diving into a critical aspect of construction, the proper spacing of rebar and matting. Whether you're building a house, a bridge, or even a driveway, getting this right is key to ensuring your structure lasts for years to come. Let's break it down. Rebar, or reinforcing steel, is like the skeleton of your concrete structure. It's responsible for providing the tensile strength that concrete lacks. But did you know that the spacing between these steel bars can make or break your project? Spacing matters for a few reasons. First, it directly impacts structural integrity. Too much distance between the bars and your concrete may not distribute loads properly, leading to weak spots. On the other hand, if the bars are too close, you could end up with issues during the pour, like concrete not filling improperly. Proper rebar spacing also helps control cracking. Concrete is strong in compression, but weak in tension. Rebar bridges this gap, and the right spacing ensures cracks are minimized by evenly distributing stress across the slab. Another important factor is durability. Proper spacing ensures there's enough concrete cover to protect the steel from moisture and corrosion. If the bars are too close to the surface, the structure may fail prematurely due to rust. Good spacing also helps with workability. When the grid is laid out correctly, it's easier to pour, vibrate, and compact the concrete, ensuring a solid, void-free finish. So, how do you know the right distance? Always refer to your structural, engineer's design or building, Codes like the Achi 318 for matting. The spacing typically ranges from 6 to 18 inches, depending on the load requirements and the thickness of your concrete slab. To sum it up, proper rebar spacing and just a technical detail, it's a foundation for safety, durability, and performance. If you're starting a construction project, don't cut corners here. Trust me, you'll thank yourself later. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more construction tips and tricks. Let me know in the comments if you want to deep dive into other critical topics. Until next time, happy building. See you in the next video.